Welcome friends. In our previous tutorial, we have created one project with Revit. And in this tutorial, we will learn how to work with different commands. As you can see, at the very top bar, you'll find some quick access tools like open, save, etc. And beneath that, you'll find a panel which have different different buttons on that you can refer to them as tabs in MS office structure architecture insert annotate analyze and lots of others in those tabs you will find different pans like build model openings etc in each pan, you will find various commands like wall, door, window, etc. In this tutorial, we will be learning about how to work with these commands. When you move over the command, you will find a quick description of that command. Just like when I mouse over wall, it says wall creates a non-structural wall in the building model and then its description. So how to work with that? Let us see. You just have to click on that command and bring it out here. Note that when you click on that the pan has been changed and it gives you a little bit modified version of all the tools that is optimal for using that particular command. You'll often find this modify button over here. So first of all, click anywhere in the middle, drag it down. You'll see it creates the wall for us and you can place wherever you want to. Depending upon your specifications, you may place it. Right now, we don't need that. So we can press escape or if you want to get rid of this command or you want to work with some other command, go here and click on modify. It will get back to you from that optimized set of pan and you are again ready to work with any other command. So this was a quick and basic tutorial upon working with commands.